Hey guys, welcome back to Dubs Booze Reviews. This week, we're looking at Smirnoff. Smirnoff was invented by Pirtos Smirnoff back in 1864, and by 1870 he was pioneering charcoal filtering. Smirnoff started as Smirnoff with a V, not a double F. When Pirtos died, his third son Vladimir took over the company, fled from Russia when Russia went dry, and went to what is now Ukraine, and then started the company as Smirnoff with a double F. Let's give it a try. It's got a little bit of kind of berry notes in there, kind of like a wild berry flavor. I mean, it's a vodka, so these notes are gonna be very subtle. Very kind of clean and crisp. You do notice the 40%, it does burn just a little bit, but it's Smirnoff vodka. Very crisp vodka. You still definitely get that wild berry note and a little, maybe a little touch of citrus in there. Definitely some vanilla as well. On the finish, you get the grains. Cocktails that Smirnoff would work great in, pretty much any vodka cocktail would be great. Anything from Moscow Mule, Sex on the Beach. One that is simple and easy and I think would go well with the subtle flavors in here, probably a Greyhound. I think that the grapefruit juice would play well with those wild berry flavors and then the lime wheel would go along with those citrus notes. A good price point, if you could get a bottle of Smirnoff for around 12 bucks, I think that's a good deal for it. It's not bad, I mean, it's a vodka. It's better actually than I expected because I haven't had Smirnoff in a very long time. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Hit that like button, share this video with your friends, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. <laughs>